Am I the asshole? For uninviting my parents to my wedding since they ruined my sisters. My parents are overbearing people. They have huge personalities and steamroll everyone who gets in their way. At my little sister's wedding this summer they were especially obnoxious. They made terrible speeches, got the DJ to play crappy music for the older folks, tried to get the photographer to do family pictures for people not in the wedding party since they was here anyway and everyone is dressed up. I could go on. But I won't. Afterwards I said that they had better not try any of that SD at my wedding. They said that it was who they were and that they weren't going to change for anyone. I talked to my fiancé about it. And we uninvited them I told them that they were welcome to come to the church as guests but that I did not want them near my wedding party during the pictures or at our reception. They are not helping us pay for the wedding so we don't really owe them anything. My sister is on my side. But the rest of the family is split down the middle. Half understand why I don't want them making a scene at my wedding. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. Not the asshole. I'm sorry, and no disrespect to your parents, but anyone who responds to a request to be considerate of you and your guests at your wedding with this is just who we are has got their head up their ass. Obnoxious I is not a defendable personality type. They said that it was who they were and that they weren't going to change for anyone. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. I love it when people tell you directly they're going to behave like assholes, and then suddenly get big offended when you treat them just like any other asshole. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. They want to be who they are, you are not interfering in that at all. But no one says you have to let them be who they are at your important events. They chose to engage in this behavior and finally they are learning that choices have consequences. Not the asshole. They can be who they are on their living room couch while you enjoy your lovely and peaceful wedding. Not the asshole it's your wedding and you're paying for it. Allowing them to attend the ceremony but not the reception is totally fair. And you can tell your family members that you're not expecting them to change, which is exactly why they aren't invited. My only question is since they're such steamrollers, how are you going to prevent them crashing the reception? They sound like the kind of people who wouldn't think twice about showing up uninvited. Parents do crappy things at Easter wedding. Op you better not do this crappy things at our wedding. Parents we won't change. Op okay so don't come. Parents and family, scared face, scared face, scared face, scared face, scared face. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You're not expecting them to change. They can be whoever they want to be and others have the right to not have to deal with who they are. Not the asshole. Stubborn parents are the worst. And it's obvious they'd repeat the same behavior at Ops wedding. And their excuse that's just who we are. Honestly it's so ridiculous when people refuse to acknowledge and take accountability for their mistakes. Enjoy your special day, congrats on getting married. Not the asshole. They can be whomever they want to be but their actions do have consequences and this is one of them. Not the asshole. You didn't actually kick them out of your wedding you told them what conditions and behavior you wanted your guests to follow, and they refused to agree to that basic code. You're not abandoning them here. They're abandoning you. Feel free to point out to your relatives that you didn't actually uninvite your parents, you just had a talk with them about how to behave like adults and they threw a tantrum and uninvited themselves. Not the asshole. If they aren't paying, they don't have a guaranteed spot, even if they're family. You know what you want your special day to look like and if they're unable to suck it up and act like adults for one day, they can act like toddlers at home. Not the asshole. If your parents cannot control their own behavior for one afternoon night that says a lot about them and their priorities. I hope you have a beautiful easy breezy wedding op congrats. Not the asshole. Your wedding, your choice. They have warned you that they won't behave change their ways for your wedding. You told them that what you saw at your sister's wedding is not what you wanted at yours and they told you they wouldn't change. So this is how shitty behavior reaps shitty rewards. Their own actions ensured that they can't be trusted. Since you don't want to worry on what the heck they will do, you told them not to come to part of your wedding celebration. Harsh? Yeah. Necessary? Absolutely? They aren't paying so they don't get to decide. Not the asshole they outright said you can expect them to act the same at your wedding. Not the asshole. But your sister had as much of a vendor problem as a parent problem. She could have warned the vendors and insisted they say no to any requests not from her or her spouse. Not the asshole. Very reasonable boundaries and if they keep pushing it they can be completely disinvited. 
not the asshole they declared their intentions to be assholes. You are believing who they have told you they are. Good job. Not the asshole it's your wedding. That they are who they are is not unacceptable. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. You aren't asking them to change, you're asking them to stay away because you know they won't. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. Tell this half of the family that you've felt this way ever since your sister's wedding and it's unfair of them to expect you to change for any reason. Not the asshole, your parents can be larger than life in their own house. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. Nah. You are being nice letting them come to the reception. Based on previous experience and their stated unwillingness to change not the asshole. Don't let them come to the reception. They're making it about themselves, not you or your sister. Not the asshole as you are only just disinviting them from the reception. Not the asshole. It's your day, and it sounds like they will ruin it for you. Not the asshole. You're not asking for your parents to change. You're applying a rule set and if they can't abide by them, they don't have to go. You said they aren't paying for anything. So they aren't entitled to be there and the fact that your family is split is a good indicator that it's probably for the best they don't come. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. But of course they expect you to change who you are from someone who won't take shit at your wedding, to someone who will. Fascinating. Not the asshole it's not really expecting people to change, it's just asking people to be on their best behavior. We all do that. I don't act the same at work as I do at home. I don't act the same at a wedding as I do when I'm out with my friends. Most people are able to modify their behavior depending on the specific event they're at. If your parents are refusing to do that then that's their choice but then they can't come. Not the asshole. Good choice. Not the asshole. We are who we are is the biggest excuse people use to refuse to acknowledge they need to improve upon themselves. Kudos to you for standing up for yourself. Not the asshole. You've asked for extremely reasonable boundaries and they not only reject them but they don't seem to even hear you or your perspective. If they care more about pushing their wants than about your happiness, that's on them. You don't expect them to change, which is why you uninvited them. Good job. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. I've been to so many weddings, I have five sisters, and everyone acted like a human being. It was great and grand. Little weather mishaps but that's okay. If they can't act like decent people, then they don't deserve a spot at your wedding. Remember that this is your day not theirs. If they want a professional photo shoot, they can book one, not try to steal yours. I would talk to your booking venue, caterer, photographer, dressmaker etc and put a verbal password on everything to make sure they don't try to change anything, since they're uninvited. They're I am who I am. Short for I'm a selfish asshole and I don't put any value on personal growth despite how my behavior may affect the people around me. So they, gave terrible speeches requested music from the DJ they liked, somehow bad and posed for a family photo? The first one seems bad but then when you consider the other two I have to assume by terrible, you mean embarrassing, which, is a standard thing that parents do. I see nothing wrong with what they did. Nah but this seems extreme and solvable by telling your photographer and DJ to ignore their requests. They are who they are. But they aren't displaying who they are. Rudeness is a behavior. Not a personality trait. They aren't expressing themselves. They're just choosing to be rude. Not the asshole. Not the asshole save yourself the stress. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. They're right. You're not expecting them to change, just managing them to make sure that who they are doesn't ruin your wedding. Not the asshole. You aren't expecting them to change. That's why they were uninvited. Don't cave to the badgering your wedding is once in a lifetime, do you really want to ruin it because a few people think that a pair of assholes should be invited, just because they're your parents? Not the asshole clearly. The other half is saying that my parents are who they are and it's unfair of me to expect them to change for any reason. Then you family can invite them to their weddings. You and your fiancé are making the right decision for the two of you. Stick to it. And have fun at your wedding. Not the asshole. You're not asking them to change. Not the asshole you don't expect them to change, that's why you don't want to be around them at your wedding. Not the asshole. You and your fiancé get to decide who attends it's that simple. 
your parents have made it clear they have no intention of respecting your wishes. Inviting them would likely embolden and reward their crappy behavior. Is it unfair of you to expect your parents to change? Well, yes. It would be. Your family is right. Which is why you are expecting your parents not to change. And taking actions based on that expectation. Not the asshole. Not the asshole it is your day not theirs.